it clearly bleeds over to the offensive end. How much do you guys pride yourselves on that, that you, you can contribute that much on the scoreboard? Um, you know, just being the first guys in the gym, man, you know, um, working on our game. And like I said, this was a much needed win. And, you know, um, we had to step up today and do what we had to do to win. So we just had to step up as best way we can. And, you know, we got it done. You called it that on Saturday, a must-win game. Uh, what does it do for this team to come out with this victory, convincing passion over the top 20 team? Um, it puts us back where we're supposed to be, you know, um, <laughs> back where we, where we want to be, you know, with a win on our belt. You know, um, never good with a, with a, with a that takes team off after two losses. And, um, like I said, in this conference, they set you back a long way. You know, we've been having a good year. We want to, um, you know, finish out the right way and capitalize on these chances. You know, with this game being on Monday, kind of set you up for <coughs> Time off, and, you know, a little time to rest, and and you know, get extra repaired for the next time. Kind of set you guys up for a good rundown here. Uh, down yeah, the stretch, you know, um, give time some, give, like give guys a chance to you know get get a, you know, a little bit more healthy. You know, Dax, myself, um, some of the bigs was banged up. You know, just give us a chance to get healthy and you know practice. Get some more time to practice and you know clean some more things up and get ready to play some more big games. Well, Could you pinpoint anything about you and Tariq specifically? What what works about the two of you in the game together? Um, like I said, we on the same page, you know. Um, we in the gym together, you know, we, we talk, we talk about what we want to do and, you know, how we could, you know, execute certain ways. And then we watch games all the time and, you know, see what we can do differently. And, you know, we just try to attack, you know. Um, just, just just try to attack and, you know, just be aggressive. You said, you said after the game out there, and you just said it today, that you, know, you guys know some of the guys on that team from JUCO level. Like, what what does that do to have that kind of a pass with some of them? Oh, you know, it's good. It makes the game more fun, you know, not only just all competitive, you know, all rah-rah, you know, but it makes it more fun, you know, when you got um, guys that you play the game to, who you're friends with, and you know who eventually, you know, when basketball's all said and done, you know, you'll know them and, you know, you'll be a good friend with them. So, you know, it just makes the game more fun and more competitive. Who specifically? Um, McKay. Playing against him? Yeah. Why? Did you have anything, any inkling coming into this game that this game was there for coming in tonight, or does it just happen out on the court? No, it just happens. You know, I just go on the court and you know just just let it all out, and what happens happens. Did you guys change the way you talk at all with each other at home? <laughs> Change what you ate, you think? <laughs> nah, we ate some Wheaties. <laughs> nah, we just came to play, man. We ate some good pregame meal today. Um, when it when it starts happening, you go almost like like unconscious, you know, like into a trance. Zone? I mean, nah, yeah, just, you're yeah, in I mean, a different zone. You know, you just. How can I explain it? You know, you're just ready for anything, you know, and loose balls, you're ready to get on the loose ball, you know, and the ball's coming your way, you're just ready to react real fast. You know, when you get the ball, you just feel like you can do a lot of different things. When you guard somebody, you feel like you can stop somebody, you know, it's just a whole different zone you're going to. And um, like I said, it starts on a defensive end and the offense comes with it. I can't even imagine that at this school, it may have even happened before that two guys came off the bench and scored 56 points and they off the bench. That's a lot of points off the bench. Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, we'll see. <laughs> it makes it easier for him to be able to get to the rim, get a couple easy buckets too, and get things started, right? Like I said, when you know, when Tariq makes six threes, you know, it opens the floor up a lot. So um, it's not just me, you know, it's when other guys make shots, it just opens up the floor and makes it a lot easier for me. Is that sort of the 